Robbie, with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzig, and the Chamberlain has the crossguard and grip. Father had them engraved in Sassau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. When did I ever botch anything? Where shall I start? Ah, shut up and give me what I want, or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I'd better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. What will it be today? I'm just after a few things I can Alright, this will do me. Here's your change, thanks. A pleasure as always. Good health to you, Henry. My God! What happened to you? You look like you've been assaulted. The usual or something else? Satin, salmon, scarlet! Hey, Pip! You can't be serious, Deutsch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to? He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Gutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? 
The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts, traitors. Now even the Pope. I'll be with you, Henry. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsche spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund and... don't and forget about Gutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but... Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words, exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? Too I, Matthew. Should give him a proper hiding. Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge parlement manure. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather torch it, to be honest. But, doing some tears will do. What do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for her father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? Oh well, father can wait a while. <laughs> My words exactly. I knew you wouldn't miss out on all the fun. Let's go. So are we doing this or not? Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. What do you want, lad? I just went by the tavern and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty! The fool! Next thing he'll start on about the Popes! He might have mentioned the Popes too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight.
What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For king and country! For king and country, my ass. This is all good, clean, fun! <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund! Woohoo! Eat shit, Doshus! You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> hey, Hans, can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Horse hunt! I'll make those smites off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this boxy Deutsche? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <laughs> <laughs> Fucker! I'll make you pay for that! Is that all you've got? God save Henry. I have it all. Thank you, Be a bit more careful. Oof. He's gone. Fucking Dutch. That was close. <laughs> I almost got caught thanks to that damn Dutch. Well, we sorted that Deutsch out. <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? That old bastard didn't stand a chance. 
True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. Well, I'll let him. Then I'll snitch on him. And anyway, what can they do to us for throwing a bit of dung? Good point. It's not as if anyone really likes the Deutsch. It's a good thing your hunker warned us. Well-behaved girl like that. I'm surprised she didn't call the catch pole. She must have seen Matthias. What do you mean? Because he fancies her. And I think maybe she likes the look of him too. Hehehe. <laughs> Shut up, you idiot. Anyway, nice job at the Deutsches. Never a dull moment with you lot. <laughs> Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? Oh, it was nothing. Except Mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. But the world's a dangerous place and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? Yes. All right, I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. So, can we get started? <laughs> 